Okay, so I'm in Bangkok, I'm in my hotel room. It's about eight o'clock in the morning. Um, the hotel has a gym upstairs, so I'm gonna, gonna do a little workout later on this afternoon, probably. Um, I think the problem for me today is gonna be where am I gonna get my calories from? Where am I gonna get 4,000 calories from without eating at McDonald's or eating shit out of 7-Eleven and we, without having my fridge and my personal chef back uh, to help me out? So. Let's see how it go. This is the Bangkok 4,000 calorie challenge. So I'm in Bangkok and lucky for me, my hotel has a McDonald's at reception. Um, yeah, I'd rather eat my own nutsack for breakfast, thanks. Well, don't get me wrong, I don't have anything against Ronald McDonald. I mean, he's always dressed really smart. I like that in a, in a fellow human, you know, taking pride in your appearance. I, I just don't like his burgers. So, I decided to hang out with him for a bit. Uh, we sat there on the bench, I had five bananas for breakfast. We had a bit of a chat. So I'm off to a cracking start. Before 7 a.m. I've already nailed 750 calories with five bananas, uh, some pineapple and papaya, which I had on the train, and a handful of sultanas and almonds on my way. Take you on a little tour of buffet breakfast. Um, what is on offer here? So we've got some, some nice pastries, um, some yogurts, some bowl full of Asian junk. Um, over here we've got the uh, the lettuce for show. I, I I don't even think it's real. It didn't get eaten. Those those tomatoes. I think they're they're plastic. Nobody ate them. This bowl full of eggs. As you can see, eggs got hammered. Everyone was into the eggs. Everyone was into the dead pig. Um, those potatoes. I had some of them. They were good. Marmalade. What is that green stuff? I had a handful of potatoes, some baguette, and some marmalade, and a handful of some of those cherry tomatoes. In the food hall in Siam Paragon, trying to find some uh, vegan options. Yeah. What is that? Really, what is that? I'd rather eat uh, Ronald McDonald's left testicle. Result, Pad Thai Ginje, no meat please, no eggs, result. So after uh, dinner I was shopping in Siam Square and I can officially declare that Siam Square is rubbish for vegans. I had to go to 7-Eleven, I was hungry, I couldn't find any options. 7-Eleven for some power snacks and three bananas. Afternoon meal was um, stir fried vegetable with rice. It's a little bit bland and boring if I'm being honest, but sometimes it's your only option. I was so busy just bombing around everywhere. Before I knew it, it was kind of 10 o'clock at night and everything was closing. And my only options were, were sort of KFC or McDonald's. And so I had to just find some fruit on the streets, had a coconut. A banana, uh, some pomelo, and a mango. But why on earth are they wrapping fruit in polystyrene and plastic? Really? Like, fruit comes in like perfect formed packages by nature. And then we just wrap it in that shit. That's just the insanity of the human species. But that last meal of the day it's just cost me the challenge. Four twelve just it just wasn't enough. I was I was looking for a plus thousand meal calorie breakthrough, so therefore I failed the challenge. But um, three three thousand four hundred calories while you're bombing around a city busy is not a bad effort. So I'll take the positive from that and keep on gaining.